Hello YouTube, welcome to my channel. Today I will be showing you how you can clone your installation, your Mac OS X installation from one disk to another. Okay, so right now I'm running Mac OS Ventura and I will be cloning Mac OS Sequoia, which is the last version the date I'm doing the video. And so I will be cloning from the internal disk. You see, I have an installation for macOS Sequoia on my internal disk, but it is too slow. So the goal is to clone it to this a data solid state drive and run the system from the external disk. Okay. So we will be using a free software. At least you can use it for several days until you have to, to pay for it, which is called Carbon Copy Cloner. And you have 30 days for evaluation. So select your source, select the, the destination and the most important part is to right click and select legacy bootable copy assistance. Otherwise it will make a clone, but it will, it will not be bootable. So if you want it to be bootable, you have to enable the that that part that I shown okay the legacy one and then it will take time depending on the size of your installation your current installation and so the video here is on double speed just for for information for you to see how it works so I will come back with the task finished which is right now so backup completed successfully so right now we have a completely clone from my internal installation which is on the main internal disk and I will be running the system from the solid state drive which is 127 gigabytes so right now I will boot the iMac so this is a really old iMac the last uh, macOS supported by Apple is Monterey, so I managed to install Sequoia with the uh, open core legacy patcher. I managed to install in the internal disk, but I was not able to do it again to the external disk. So the right solution was to clone. So let's see if it is working. Okay, so this, this is the EFI with the Open Core Legacy Patcher and you see I have the, the on the left Sequoia in the internal disk and I have on the right the, the clone which is on the external disk USB. So I will be running the system from external disk and it runs really well. So it's really hard to open an old iMac like this one so it requires some skills I will, I will not do it so I will be using this solid straight drive from the USB because it's simple works it works really well so as you see it's working really well so right now we are booting into the system from the USB drive from the drive we just cloned and I will show you that is the same drive, okay? So I will change now to the screen of the, of the iMac. Okay, so if we go to storage, you will see that the drive that I'm using, it's the solid state drive with 127 gigabytes, which is the same one, okay? So everything is working really well and but if you are not yet convinced i will show you now disk utility and let's check the drives okay so if we open disk utility we see that i still have the internal drive which is this one which was the source And now if I can, this is the, the clone that is working 
perfectly okay so now you know now you know how to clone a macOS installation it's really easy so if you learned something with this video don't forget to hit the thumbs up consider to subscribe the channel for more videos and here you have it uh, a really old iMac 21 from 2013 running macOS Sequoia I catch you on a new video bye bye if you like this video please subscribe